Providence, Rhode Island, the Holloway family has been targeted by a ghost claiming to be the spirit of a 13-year-old girl. When veteran investigator Joe Citrone records a threatening voice, he wonders if the couple is involved in something more sinister than a spirit board. So, what we have here is... When I presented them the evidence and I played them that EVP, and I looked at their faces and they seemed like they were horrified. Like they looked at each other and, and they just, their faces just dropped. I told them that I thought it was something that was very dark. I think that the target was for the child. And I believe that there was more going on to the story. And that's when I said, listen, if there's anything you need to tell me, now's the time to say it. And they paused and they looked at each other and they said, well, I'll be honest. I've been reading some books on witchcraft. They had this black witchcraft book, thick, old looking, creepy looking book. The couple admit to having tried to summon the dead. Are you kidding me? Like, do you know the dangers and, and how you just put yourself and your child at danger by trying to summon spirits and, and beings you know nothing about? You don't know what you're messing with on the other side. It's a dangerous place to be. The couple's admission is a troubling development. Once I knew that they were engaged with witchcraft, I knew at that point they didn't summon a little girl. I think it was a dark entity, and I think the motive was to harm that child. I, I firmly believe that the payback for summoning this spirit was their child.